Hey YouTubers, welcome to Duality 9X, your portal to the mysterious and unexplained. Join us as our guest as we delve into the eerie world of TikTok. TikTok, TikTok, TikTok. We're going to unravel some very weird, unusual, and scary videos. So, if you enjoy our content, and if you're intrigued by the unknown, please like and subscribe. That'll always help us out. And let's get ready to explore. I got my cup, guys. Are you guys ready? So buckle up. Let's do this. All right, so what do you got? What do we got? Our first video. <laughs> what did I just see? What did I just see? So look, I'm, I'm, I'm trying, we're trying to cut like, okay. I'm gonna I'm gonna watch that one more time, and welcome to the weird side of it. So it's a weird video. Hey, so we weren't lying. I mean, and not everything's gonna be supernatural or paranormal. That is just weird. There's a whole bunch of onlookers looking at a bunch of grown adults dressed up as sheep and acting as sheep. Very weird. Very weird. Okay, let's see what else we got. Giants. I love I love looking, you know. Okay, that, that was really quick, that was pretty fast. I I I, I like giants. I, I like the the topic of giants. Um you know there's a lot of cool videos and and people who claim to have done this research on on finding evidence of these giant creatures, giant people even, um, around the world. You know, places in South America, in the Middle East, uh, just just all over the place, right? And people are trying to people are trying to create the notion that these beings, that these people, uh, these these giants have been around for quite some time. And then somehow they, they all disappeared. They all died off. Now, when I, when I look at this video, and I'm looking at this one video here, and I'm looking at this dude, and you, know, you notice that, like as I zoom in, first of all, I, I, I can't help, I, I can't help, <laughs> I'm trying to hold my laugh in, but but I see Homer Simpson. Do you guys see Homer Simpson? I I see like a like almost like a Homer Simpson. He's got well, this this particular entity, human being, creature has a lot of lines across his forehead, almost similar to that of like an elephant. Wide wide nostrils. And if you look at the eyes, one of the eyes, like the left eye is kind of closed and then the right eye is kind of open. Um, looks very AI-like. And then you look at these people. And look, look, look at this one guy here in the bottom left-hand corner. His one eye is like, like you know, you know his pu pupils are completely dilated. And then you look at some of these other figures. They don't look real. And, and maybe they are real people, but yeah, bizarre. All right, let, let's, uh, that was a quick little video. Next. Bizarre videos that they tried to delete. From bizarre videos that they tried to delete from the internet. Okay. 
I just threw hot water? Okay, let's 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 go back. Let's let's check it out again. Bizarre videos that they tried to delete from the internet. Okay, so so somebody was heating up um, some water or, or boiling up boiling some water and. And you heard the wailing, right? I heard that as well too. And I, at first, I thought, okay, you know, sometimes, sometimes you hear this particular kind of noise, and it's usually uh, like, like some cougars or uh, bobcats. You know, bobcats can make some very sc scary, very eerie noises. Even even cats. If you hear cats, you know, like um, cry or make these noises. Sometimes, you know, this. It could be pretty odd. It could be pretty scary. So that's kind of what I'm thinking first here. But uh, I want to watch this video one more time. And it sounds like some people are crying or wailing. I wonder where this video was filmed. they threw the water you heard this thing go ah! like it's just and and there was a there was a, um uh kind of like a patch there on the road so i'm i'm, I'm assuming uh, I'm, I'm thinking that perhaps this person had already thrown some water in that spot and, and they did it again there is some weird stuff that goes on guys in in, in the world and uh Imagine you're me scrolling on your for mm -hmm. you page uh, in the middle of the night and you see this. Woo! Now, what the this hell is, is that? Let's get that out of the way first. Oh, so hold on. Let's pause, 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 pause. Married this doll. What is going on? Is this Halloween? Okay, so this is bloody crazy. You know, th this is insane. This is not. This is not normal, and this is some kind of like a prank, you know. And you know, almost ninety percent of these, time ninety percent of the time, I'm gonna think that people are just doing this for content. Why on earth would you take a picture with something so ridiculously crazy like that? Okay, if it's Halloween, I get it. You know, if it's a joke, whatever. like an entire family of like zombie dolls but is this not so like unnerving and also is that not like a child zombie doll i understand this is not what my like page normally is about like it's usually like crime and like hauntings and stuff like that but like this, this is freaking, is freaking me, out. me out and you know what i am going to watch this one Imagine you're me okay. scrolling on your for you page right. uh, in the middle of the night and Right, not normal. Now, this is a doll. Now, yeah. this is a doll. Okay. Let's get that out of the way first. It's a doll. And this woman married this doll. People are marrying dolls. Show them at their wedding. And she has like an entire family of like zombie dolls. But is this not so like unnerving? And there's and there's there's a there's another doll in the also, background. That it looks not like, like Chucky. A child zombie doll. I understand this is not what my like page normally. Also, is about. this lady like, does like, videos. And, like, and stuff like that, but, but like, not this videos like this. This is not one of the normal videos that she she usually posts. But obviously, she was intrigued enough to the point where she had to had to expose this. There 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 is some weird things going on, and you know when it comes to dolls, dolls are just one of those things that. They're just scary. They're just scary. So, 
Uh, you, you know, the fact that this person married probably one of the sc most scariest dolls that I've ever seen ever. And I don't know if this doll was like a movie prop for like The Walking Dead, like some zombie apocalypse. I don't know. But this is not normal. It's not normal behavior. And this is, that's, um, and again, you know, I, I, I beg to question, was this done purely for the sake of content or was this done because they genuinely felt love and 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 these feelings for this doll this zombie looking doll that had half his face ripped off and somebody said i dig you i am attracted to you now that that when they say beauty lies in the eyes of the beholder uh that that's this is taking it to a whole new level Okay, what I, I just I just missed something here. Oh, let's see this again. Okay. Yeah, let's just walk off into the woods and disappear into the brush. Oh, look at this gangly. What the heck is that? Somebody's room? And the music is just so weird. It's just so creepy. Oh, no, no. Don't throw her in. Don't. What? Yay! <laughs> and now he's... Okay, come on, what's going on? Yeah! That is scary. I don't even know where to begin. I don't even know what to say. Uh, you know, just looking at this video. That's a weird dude. Uh, so somebody's wearing a mask and I'm, I'm a little worried about this one scene here where he's trying to throw this person or this person's in a wheelchair and they're pushing him it looks like they're just trying to shove him downstairs so where's this per where's this person supposed to go uh, they're on a wheelchair there's obviously no ramp is he just chucking them down the stairs I mean I hate to use that kind of okay I don't know I just and then this guy right at the end here. That's scary. All right. Let's move on. Let's move on. Weird things caught on camera. Weird things caught on camera. Oh, did you just see that? There was a pizza delivery guy, and it looked like he was eating toppings from the pizza that he's about to deliver to somebody. And this guy's like braiding somebody's hair or smelling it. Oh, hey, did we just see this video? We just saw this guy in a video. And he just pulled this person. Oh. I, I got goosebumps there. Uh... Oh! She just trips and then this lady just clo grabs her things and closes her. Knowing that the ele something's wrong with the elevator, and I don't know what this guy's doing to that poor woman. This is scary. Look how he just yanks this girl and he just disappeared to the closet. This girl is saying, "Help me." You know, there, there. Uh, I've seen some videos. I've seen some videos where. You, you find some people and, and you know like actually in a room and you know there's like a 
I'll, I'll try to see if I can find it, but there was this one where there was they, they locked this guy up. Uh, or, um, sorry, I'm skipping ahead here. Uh, they found this one guy. I guess he applied for some kind of a game show, and uh, he, he he was a contestant to try to get onto this game show, and and he ended up winning. And he was so excited, and he was bragging about it to his friends and his family, and you know he got onto this game show, or what he thought was a game show, and uh, he was actually doing kind of like a, a reality or like a YouTube kind of a you know thing, and he was just locked in a room, and he was like that for months and months and months. I I think even maybe a year or something along those lines, and he was completely disconnected from the entire world. He uh, had no contact with anyone. Time to time and occasionally somebody would come in and drop some food off or, or some things for him to uh, use. And, and the, the weird thing about all this was that he was, he, he was told to strip down. He had like no clothes on, no nothing, and uh, just like nothing. And people were live streaming and watching him. And so the contents, the creators, sorry, the, uh, the content creators were, were making all this money and gained all this popularity. And, but people started to realize that something was wrong. And so, at, you know, obviously they started to pull the plug on this. And, and what ended up happening is they told this guy that the game show is kind of coming to an end and he won the prize. I don't know what the prize was, but um, obviously it couldn't have been that much. I mean, this individual had lost their ability to they lost I'm, I'm sure whatever social you know what, what whatever whatever emotions whatever they had mentally i mean they were completely distraught psychologically speaking to the point where they didn't even know how to connect and act around people so it was a if this was a psychological experiment it was a psychological experiment that went completely upside down and um, it was a it was a really really terrible thing that anyone can do to any any human being you know when I see these kind of videos with somebody holding a help me sign um, I mean that's even if this is done in parody and you know if it was just meant for fun that's not funny you know um, one can only imagine if that was a true video or not kind of sick you know anyhow I digress Listen, anybody can eat whatever they want to eat. No judgment here. I just don't understand how people eat things that are still moving. Okay, like how do you how do, do that? you do that? Like how does something wiggle in your mouth and you enjoy it? Like how do you eat that and suck on that and enjoy it? Okay, and them bugs, they look like they were they were made from God crispy already because they look very crispy. All right, they may be full of vitamins, but I just other than that, I cannot understand. I can't. Again, no judgment. No judgment, because it might be good. But how do you just enjoy yeah. something wiggling in yeah. your mouth? Like, how do I you know. just... I don't know. How, how do you... You know, okay, look, if, if I lived in the Amazon jungle, if I lived in a place where there wasn't hmm, your local convenience store, uh, you know, you had to live off the fat of the land, right? You were... The only thing that was around you was whatever you planted in the ground. And in order for you to get any kind of protein, it would have to be from some kind of insect, bug, or whatever you catch, if you can catch it, like a rabbit, hare, I don't know. Um, this looks like it was an experiment. Or somebody must have paid this individual some money to just get down Julie Brown and grab and look at that spoon. This wasn't your ordinary spoon that you pull out of your drawer. Uh, this was a pretty big spoon. And now, um, I mean, yeah, if they're paying you like $100,000, um, oh, jeez, I don't know. I don't know. Can you do it? If somebody paid you a ton of money to do this, would you? Would you do it? Honestly, I'd love to hear the comments. I'd love to hear your comments. If somebody paid you $100,000 to eat one scoop, would you do it? 
Yeah. Wow. Next. Skinwalker design. Or, uh, sorry, Skinwalker disguised as a deer. Hello. It just looks like a regular deer. Very creepy deer. Boy! <laughs> Don't look. <laughs> Jeez. You see the eyes? Uh. The deer couldn't get inside the house, so it's just just waiting outside with its eyes wide open. That's freaky. That's when you know you need a dog, right? Something. Okay. A, a scary video, finally. Sister. Look at the eyes. Look at that, like, kind of demonic kind of smile. And just sleeping away. And this person is not even speaking like a girl. What are they doing? Is this for content? Was this genuine? I was hoping to intrigue you guys with some scary videos. Um, let, let's see what's in the next one. It's got appendages. Okay. It, it can grab what things. What is this? Oh, what the hell? What? That doesn't look like oh, a look at that. There's some paw. It looks like a... That looks like a cougar. <laughs> or a bear. A bear's paw. Did you guys hear about the story about this bear that was living under somebody's porch? It was like hibernating there. And... Yeah. But look at this. Like, what is that? And where is this video? It's got appendages. It, it can grab things, but it just, I don't know why. That doesn't oh. look like a raccoon. And look how, like, that's a pretty big claw or paw. Okay, we'll fuck out of our room. <laughs> no. You know what? That could be like, I don't know if it's a sloth. I don't know. Like, it can't be a raccoon. Because raccoons are known sometimes for living in people's like attics and houses, and they find wherever they can just to kind of sneak in. And uh, and and I've heard a lot of stories about raccoons living in people's uh, property, but that looked like a pretty big paw with like your claws, um, almost like a black panther, right? Almost like a cougar. And if you have a cougar living in your home, I'd like to hear about it. I'd like to talk about it. In fact. I would love to hear what's the craziest critter or like have you guys ever had like I'd love to hear any kind of stories about anyone who's uh, ever encountered a very weird pest living in your home or knowing of somebody who who that happened to I've, I've heard of people with like spiders and wolf spiders and you know like really big kind of insects you know in their home and taking pictures of it and you know raccoons we talked about raccoons that's scary stuff man like, what would you do like if i saw that and I'm, that's my home I, I wouldn't go inside the house no way would i go inside that house i mean if you got a, if that's a cougar okay all right guys it's a short one today I look forward to sharing more content with you guys and until our next mysterious mind bending, mind blowing encounter and stay tuned. And in the meantime and in between time, that's it. Until our next adventure, I'll catch you guys on the next one. Peace.